Oh, well, everybody's heard about the bird. Bird, bird, bird. The bird's a winner. Well, the bird, bird, bird. Bird is a winner. Well, the bird, bird, bird. Well, the bird is a winner. Well, the bird Hi, welcome to another beer review. And today we're going to be reviewing the Budweiser American Ale. And it's the first time I've had this one. Um, so I don't really know what to expect. Uh, I'm not sure what the ABV is, so I'll try to post it on the, the right over there. And uh, let's see if the bottle says anything interesting. Carefully brewed with barley from America's heartland and cascade hops from the Pacific Northwest. This rich, amber-colored ale has robust flavor and distinctive hoppy finish. Let's see if Budweiser has the ability to manufacture a drinkable beer. So, we are going to... <laughs> that was terrible. I am, I am sorry. I am sorry. I am sorry. Okay, uh, I just got this out the fridge, so it's pretty cold. Uh, I'm going to use a mug for this guy. You know, fuck it, you know? So, crack it open there. And uh, let's see if I can get the pour in on the camera well. Right. Nice smoke pouring out of there. Uh, bit of a glug, glug, glug going. Alright, look at that. We have a really, really nice color. Looks very tasty. Uh, head looks good. Swirl around a little bit there. Doesn't look like we're going to get too much lacing. Um, color of the head, pretty white. You know, maybe, a, maybe a hair off, but for the most part, pretty white. Let's have a smell and see what we smell. Mm. Smell some hops there. Strong hoppy smell to it. Maybe a little bit of malt. That's really all I get about the smell. Head looks like it's fading quick, but we'll keep an eye on it. Not many bubbles coming up from the bottom either. Uh, let's try to get another smell here. Yeah, I get a little bit of malt. I get, I get pretty big hoppiness, and my light is being an asshole. So we're just going to go with it. Um, Let's see how it tastes, because taste is always the most important thing. Mmm. I actually like that. It's pretty good. Um, very little bit of bitterness in the end. Mouthfeel feel, feels about right to me. Oh, there we go. Got a little lacing there. Got this mood. Good old mood. Um, yeah, it's, it's drinkable. Um... Like I said, the finish is a little bit hoppy, but nothing nothing bad. I mean, certainly nothing like, I mean, don't think you're going to get this and get like an IPA kind of hoppy bitterness to it. Let's have another swig here. Mm. Ah, fucking A. Um, there are more of that lacing there. Lacing's actually looking pretty nice. Um, in the taste, I get a hoppy taste to it. Uh, maybe a little bit of that malt I smelled in it. Uh, yeah, it's certainly full-bodied beer. Uh, head's still hanging in there, but I did drink this one pretty fast. So, I don't know. It's kind of fading. Um, <clears throat> lacing's good, though. I mean, the taste, the taste is good. It, it's just right. Um, it's not perfect, but it's certainly above average. Yeah, certainly, certainly above average. Um, it is, you know, filtered so you can see, you know, you see my hand right through it, but it's just got a really nice color. And I don't know how well it's coming out on the camera, but that color is just it's really nice. I'm looking right through the light there. That's really, really nice color looking to it. Um, Drinkability is good. Like I said, there's just that little bit of a hoppiness to it on the aftertaste, but it's gone pretty quick. I mean, you can guzzle these all day. Just guzzle them all day. And uh, I'm surprised. I'm surprised Budweiser made a drinkable beer that I actually like. Which, uh, well, that's all I can say about that as well. Uh, again, this is the Budweiser American Ale. Uh, you know, and for the price, actually, talk about that for a minute. For the price of this, I'm surprised it's this good because, you know, I was in the store today and I was looking, I wanted to get a case of something new, and this stuff was like 20 bucks, 21, I think it was 21.50, so about 22 bucks for the case, 
And, uh, you know, after just reviewing that Sam Adams, I was going to get a case of that. Through the case of that was about 30 bucks. So you're saving about eight bucks going with this. It's, I don't think it's as good as Sam Adams. I'd probably give it anywhere from a C plus to a regular B. But again, I like to let things settle. I like to let things really, you know, settle down before I really do the final. So the final will be in the end of the video. Um, if I was going to review this or pair this with food, um, you know, everybody knows I like hamburgers. But uh, I mean, I can't keep just saying hamburgers for a beer because I could do that. Um, I, w I wouldn't mind drinking this with like a chicken, with like a nice seasoned chicken, not a fried chicken, like a baked seasoned chicken, something, something money like that. That would probably be very good as a nice little dinner. But you know, lacing's good. I mean, it's not as bad as I thought it was going to be when I first poured it. Um, I have another taste here. It's going to flow. Yeah, it's pretty good. It's pretty good. It's, uh, that color is just fantastic, though. The color just looks tasty. So, if you haven't tried it, and you're not a fan of Budweiser, um, try it, because it's, it's definitely worth a shot. I'm not promising you the world, and I'm not saying that you're going to have a beer gasm over this beer. But it is good, and I think it certainly, certainly is worth a try from anybody who's interested in uh, nail like this. Finish is pretty clean. I mean, I don't even, after drinking this whole thing, I don't even get as much bitterness as I was getting from, to, from the beginning. Probably like the palate is adjusting to the bitterness. But I recommend it. There's your final lacing verdict. I'd say average, maybe a little bit below average lacing. So if you haven't tried it, once again, it's Budweiser American Eagle. There's a badass looking eagle on the front, and the eagle's like, you're going to drink my beer. So I drank it. It's, it's gone. And uh, we'll see you next time. Enjoy your beer. I'm getting drunk. <laughs> Bye.